You guys ready for your first comic tonight? Oh yeah. This guy is awesome. He became a close friend of mine when I met him through a roommate, not gonna lie, no cool story. But he's a funny motherfucker. He's been on Laughs and Raps before. Please give a warm welcome to the one and only Mr. Timothy Deem. How's it going? How's everyone doing? I need your guys' help tonight. My girlfriend told me that if I do well, and I'm quoting, she said she was going to fuck my brains out. So I'm gonna need everyone to give it up for laughs. <laughs> I got excited, man. I shaved and everything. Porn star shave, not, the, uh, not that sandpaper shit. You know what I'm talking about? So there's sometimes when guys are shaved, it starts growing back, feels like sandpaper. Girls are shaved, it starts growing back, feels like sandpaper. And guys have this magical move that they do when they're having sex, where they pretend like they're trying to grab the girl and be real close to them when it's really just, we're, we're tired. I'll show you right now, hold on. One of these, can you all hear me? Yeah. One of this, right here. Oh yeah. Oh, what's up baby, how you doing? Oh. When that happens, and you're both shaved, and the planets are aligned, oh, motherfucker, does that hurt. And I don't know what's in spermicidal lubricant, but I clearly, condoms, and the spermicide, and the rash, and the burning, it doesn't work, make me not want to have sex again, tell you what. Guys, you ever get spermicidal lubricant in your pee hole? You know that move where you put it on, oh shit, it's the wrong way? That type of pain make me fall out. Just forget what, what how, are you all right, baby? I don't even know. I think we need to start going to church again. This shit hurts like a motherfucker. Painful. Haven't been getting laid as much lately. Moved in with the girlfriend. You know, that doesn't go well. She bought me a loofah and I watch Grey's Anatomy because I have to catch up on it. Whatever the hell that, Grey's Anatomy is the type of show that make you think you, Double check your sexuality. You know what I'm talking about, guys? Patrick Dempsey, you ever seen him? Gorgeous. I don't even care. You can say what you want about it. I watch Grays. I watch Teen Mom 3. And I bleed from my penis. <laughs> Teen Mom 3 makes me want to fly around the country just hit people. Just get mad and punch them in the face. I'm not saying any teen that is a mom is bad. I'm just saying when you throw a camera in the child's face and start bitching at her boyfriend or whatever, it makes me want to hit people. I hate it. Drive around the country is no good. I don't like driving. I get nervous. A lot of Asian drivers. I know the joke, all right? Asians aren't good at driving, but it's clearly because they can't open their eyes all the way. You know this, and I know this. You want to make fun of a retard for driving like a retard, you say, well, he's a retard. I apologize. They can't open their eyes. I'm not saying Asians are retards. Settle down. Black women drivers get me nervous as hell. Where are all the black women at? Make a noise. One noise. That's all right. I'm coming to you, man. Settle down. Black women... You know, you're driving, somebody cuts you off. What do you do? You honk. You let them know, hey, here I am. A black woman will make you feel like you did it. Like it was your fault. Like you honk. Yeah, motherfucker, I did it. What? Well, I got rolling up the windows and shit. Nervous as a motherfucker. Anytime you see a black woman yelling at somebody, you always see a black guy standing behind her shaking his head like this. God damn, motherfucker. I'm glad it's him and not me, son of a bitch. Speaking of that, what do I got, three black guys here? Which one of you three is gonna get together with all your other fellow black guys let Miley Cyrus know that she doesn't have an ass? Anyone? You're gonna go up to her and let her know? Shit's nasty. She's like a mix between Marilyn Manson and Lady Gaga. Like if they had a baby, she tries to be shocking and she isn't. Nasty. My girlfriend recently bought a bunch of Disney movies. Anyone here like Disney? Woo! Disney. Disney. Kids watching Disney isn't the best idea. I used to watch Disney. I know a lot of you used to watch Disney, and it puts perverted thoughts in your head, and you know this. Oh, don't look at me like, what are you talking about, Disney? Over, sideways, and under on a magic carpet ride? <laughs> Darling, it's better. Down where it's wetter. Says eat pussy to me, and it says eat pussy to you, too. 
Man, I learned that at four years old. I guess it's supposed to go down where it's wetter. Beauty and the Beast, y'all took something home from Beauty and the Beast like I did? Anyone? If you're a beast or a nerd and you lock a bitch in your basement for long enough, she will learn to love you eventually. <laughs> Lion King, I don't care what you say, if there was a way to make a cartoon lion into a real lion and or a real person, I'd fuck the shit out of Nala. Don't even say it. Beautiful looking lion. Have you seen her eyes? What about when she was licking that water up? Uh, looking up, oh my God. I seen a few pornos that had the same exact shot. You know what I'm talking about. It's just the same way as the Black guys like uh, that big sea witch bitch from fucking Little Mermaid, you know what I'm talking about? Yes, yes you do like her. Big ass thick bitch, I know what you like. And tell me. Obama recently shut it down. That's gangster as hell, isn't it? Two weeks ago they were arguing about whether or not we had to go to Syria or not. Republicans saying, we need to go fight in Syria. Democrats saying, we don't need to. Obamacare says, shut, shut this bitch down right now. We're done. Republicans, are we going to still have the pizza on Friday? There's a pizza party Friday. We're shutting down the pizza party and the ice cream social. I don't want to hear it. It's done. Some bullshit. Nobody wants to go to Syria and fight anyway. A lot of fighting in other countries about things that we believe that other people don't believe. I don't agree with that. I don't think many people agree with that, but it happens. I think we need to find something that we all agree on that we don't like, like the dentist. Anyone here like the dentist? No. One time I went to the dentist, that dentist told me that he was gonna drill my tooth without numbing me. I said, you better not, motherfucker. We got a different plan right now. I got a record that day, I'll, I'll, I'll admit to it. Drill went right through his goddamn head. Felt good too. It's not even the dentist that we have to worry about though, is it? It's those succubi that they have come in before they come in, you know what I'm talking about? They say, this tastes like cherry, it just tastes like ch a horse's ass. I've never tasted cherry that tastes like a horse's ass. This shit's nasty, whatever toothpaste they use. Then they start hacking away at your teeth and shit with those claws. Mmm, you don't brush your teeth enough, you're bleeding. Oh, settle down, Captain Hook. I don't brush my teeth enough? No, you just daggered me with a sickle. That's why I'm fucking bleeding. It's fucking nasty. So obviously you can see that I'm a nerd. I enjoy the finer things in life, like comic books and shit. Like I was a nerd my entire life. Not like a good nerd either, not like a nerd that knows shit. You know what I'm talking about? Like, like I never was picked for part partner day in algebra class was always the Asian. He became the football. Chu, Chun Wei, me, me, me and you. We're partners right now, right? Not me. I'm the type of nerd that could tell you what, what comic book the Joker first appeared in and shit like that. I don't actually know that. I can Google it for you and let you know, but that's the type of shit I'm interested in. Anyway, honey, is this enough to get laid tonight or? I'm done? Thank you all very much. I'm getting laid tonight. I appreciate it. Give it up for Tim Dean one more time.